A manhunt is underway for the gunman who shot a federal agent in Chicago this morning. The agent with the Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco and Firearms is part of a unit formed last year to reduce gun violence in America's third largest city. Adriana Diaz is there. Just after 3 a.m., a federal agent was working undercover with Chicago police when he was shot in the face. We have shots fired on 45th and Hermitage. The unidentified ATF agent was ambushed while conducting a surveillance operation on the city's south side. Police Superintendent Eddie Johnson. I've ordered specialized units into the area to ensure the safety of the community residents and to conduct a manhunt for anyone involved in this reprehensible crime. Hundreds of officers have fanned out to search for suspects. The wounded agent is part of Chicago's gun strike force formed last year to track down illegal guns. It's a problem we saw firsthand last summer. How easy is it for someone to get a gun? That easy. You want one? Yeah. No. Just like that. <laughs> That's you know? how easy it is. President Trump has repeatedly said violent crime in Chicago is out of control. Last year, 20 ATF agents were sent to the city to be part of the strike force, along with city and state police. This is our forensic lab. On ATF wheels. special agent in charge, Salinas Nunez, leads the group, which includes this state-of-the-art mobile crime lab. When you can match shell casings, you can match crime scenes. Now you have a possible suspect. Eventually will lead us to the gun. So far this year, shootings are down 26% compared to last year. But still, there have been nearly 600 shootings since January. Adriana, what is the latest on the agent's condition tonight? Jeff, I don't know if you just heard that bang. That's a flashback. The agent is in stable condition, but just as we were preparing to go live, all of these police vehicles that are unmarked arrive. We saw uh, a SWAT team enter a building over here and just... To my right, there are police agents conducting a raid right now. So the agent is in stable condition. He's expected to make a full recovery. But this investigation is unfolding at this moment. Yeah, we heard that flashbang. So it is uh, taking place as we speak right now. I know you're, you'll stay on the story. You've done a lot of reporting on shootings um, in Chicago. Adriana Diaz, thank you very much.